Hey beauties, it's Sherry, and I am showing you my, it's kind of a vlog here on Sunday of Labor Day weekend, of um, my coffee obsession. People have been asking me forever, what is it that you love to put in your coffee? Well, okay, we all know if you lived inside my purse that I always carry around these little K-cups that go inside the little um, Keurig machine. Now, I start off the day, I was mentioning these little espresso beans. Um, not only are they absolutely scrumptious, they remind me a lot of one of my BFFs that had passed away. So, I love these. And yum, yum, yum. Okay. All right. So, I start off with those. And I know I'm going to get a lot of hate on this one. They're going to say, that's so unhealthy. But it really isn't. I don't drink that much coffee. But anyways, well, yeah, I do. Okay, but anyways, here's my Keurig. This is what I do in the morning. I make a big, this is not just for me, a big thing of, like I'll take these little K-cups and put them in here and I make a big thing of coffee and then I add um, the syrups that I buy over at Starbucks. They look like this. And then um, I add some Splenda that I buy at Costco. And I put it in there and add some ice. And oh my goodness. The very best part are these little gems. I love them. I'm surprised I did not pull them out of my little tricks yesterday because I always have them with me. If you look at them, I love to put these in my iced coffee because it makes it taste like a mocha. It's so good. This is a cookies and cream. Now you do is stick your little straw in. You can make chocolate milk and all kinds of good stuff with it. Okay. So, yeah, that is what I do in the morning, and then if I'm lucky enough, I will get some Starbucks, like, from the real place sometime soon, but probably right not now. I'm not going to for a while, but anyways, um, here's another thing that I really, really like is a pour-over, and if you go to Starbucks, actually, like, after, I think, 2 o'clock, they'll do this for a decaf coffee, unless you get an Americano, like, decaf, which I would suggest. I think it's absolutely yummerific, but okay. Yeah, this thing right here, all you do is put in a filter if you've never seen it before, put in coffee grounds and then pour the water on it and let it kind of pee at the bottom. And you can, it's just like an awesome cup of coffee. Kind of French pressy, but not really. Okay, now, here is the scary part. I am going to show you my K-Cup stash. Okay, now, here is part one of, well, I guess one place I put my K-Cups. Now, you will see. They are organized at least. I have so many different flavors. It's ridiculous. That one's blueberry, dark magic, um, vanilla, uh, more blueberry, pumpkin spice, southern pecan, everything you could ever imagine. Even apple cider. Okay, that's the one place I keep it. Now I have another place in here is a box from Costco of the Starbucks ones. And then I am so blessed that the Coffee Mountain place has like sent me a gazillion boxes of this stuff. I even have a whole box of hot chocolate and it's never been opened or anything like that as well. Okay, now the good part, the very good part of this video, now that you've watched me, I even have like little to-go cups. Now, don't think I'm the only person that drinks this stuff, okay? A, I'm not. B, I have tea as well. I'm a big green tea drinker and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I went to Costco yesterday and I got that on sale for $2. Yay me! Okay, anyways, it doesn't matter. So, anyways, what's so cool about this video is, yeah, I am doing a giveaway. Now... If you love coffee as much as I do, and you actually do have a Keurig, I will send you a box of whatever flavor you want of the, of the K-Cups. Um, whatever flavor you want. All you do is subscribe to my channel, go into the comment box, and say, okay, that is what I want from, um, you know, the Keurig, whatever. That is my favorite kind of coffee. Okay, if you don't have that, and you love coffee or just hot chocolate, and you want me to send you like um, a gift card to Starbucks for like $20, I can do that too. So this is for everybody. Or if you want like the pour over, say, listen, Miss um, Coffee Crazy Lady, I would like um, a pour over. Okay, cool. That's yours then. All right. 
Or if you would all rather, if you're like me and you're a sweet tooth like the chocolate covered espresso beans, I will send you a box of espresso beans. Because I think this is such a like really interesting giveaway. I've never seen one before on it. Yeah, I was going to tell you all, I love the coconut milk and the almond milk mixed together. We were just talking about this the other day, a friend of mine and I were, and so absolutely yummy. Try to add coconut as much as you can. Look at, I kind of veered off a little bit, but right here is like so unbelievably yummy. It's coconut butter. It's so good. Oh, love it, love it, love it. Okay, now, um, like I said before, I love these little straws. If you haven't seen them before, you've got to go grab them. All right, this video is five minutes long. i got to cut it. And so, yeah, that's the deal. If you would like to enter my coffee um, little giveaway, everyone that enters know that I will pick two winners, two. Two winners in a week from today. On That will be like Sunday, September something. I don't know exactly what the date is, but... This is September 2nd right now, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, so this is September 2nd. I'm going to put this up here in just a few minutes on YouTube. And um, know that I might be doing a live chat this week. If I do, I'll let you all know. But like I said before, just put in the comment box um, what you'd like to win. If you love the Keurig, if you don't, if you want a, just a Starbucks gift card, that's fine. If you want the pour over, cool. The supposed to be in cool. It's basically you choose what you all like. Anyways, gorgeouses, I love you all. I thank you all for looking at my coffee obsession. And, um, yeah, if you go and see me at Starbucks, you'll know because I have a crazy drink there, too. So, I love you all, and I thank you, and I hope you all have a bombshell day. Bye.